excited to have tonight's guest. He is a comedian and actor with a new memoir out called I'm Not a Terrorist, But I've Played One on TV. Please welcome Maj Jabrani! Yeah! Yeah! What's up? What's up? Oh, How are you guys oh, doing? Yeah. Hello. Hello. What's up? What's up? Yeah. Come on, get yes. in there with the guest. Yes. 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 He's a man right. of the people. Here we go. Come on. Hey! How are you guys? Good to see you. Hug it out. My God. You are a man of the people, man. Yeah. I'm crazy a of, for you. A lot of brownness in that hug. Oh, I love it. <laughs> love it. So much brownness, Moz. We are so delighted that you're here today. Thank you so much for coming by. Thank you for having me, oh, girl. Yeah. <laughs> Your kids are adorable, by the way. Just oh, them backstage. thank you. Yes, oh, yes. Cuties. They're watching this backstage, ripping the green room apart. <laughs> yeah, they are. You're you living the learn. American dream. I mean, oh my gosh, this is amazing. You uh, should have your first memoir out, which we're so uh, excited about. Yes. So uh, tell us about the migration over here to the States for you. That happened when you were six, right? Yeah, when I was six years old, I was born in Iran, and mm -hmm. uh, late 70s, the Iranian revolution was happening, and a lot of people didn't realize that the revolution was actually going to be successful. Right. So my father was on business in New York, and he sent for my mother to bring me and my sister to New York to be with him during our winter break. Mm -hmm. And I always say, we actually, we didn't think we were going to be staying. We, we packed for two weeks, we stayed for 35 years. <laughs> so yeah, that was, that was the revolution, and wow. here I am, you know? And here you are today. Yeah. Did your parents, were they always like, oh yeah, be a comedian, that's fine. Or oh, absolutely. There... Iranian parents, definitely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, parents, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know how it is. Indian parents. Hey, man, just do whatever you want, bro. We yeah. don't care. <laughs> no, it is crazy, man. Immigrant parents are so hardcore about it, because I think, you know, they, they take, it was hard for them. They, yeah. they struggle, they get out here. And they go, you got to be a lawyer or a doctor or an engineer. Yes. And it was funny, like even when I would tell my mom I wanted to be a comedian, she'd be like, I think I heard lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no, comedian. And then she goes, you know what? Why don't you just become a lawyer and you can do comedy on the weekends? <laughs> That's or, how it works. Yeah, yeah. Or you could tell jokes in court. I was like, okay. Yes. Yeah. Right. You'd be like, Your Honor, I'm gonna prove that this he's guilty. But before I do, why did the chicken cross the road? You know? <laughs> um, but it was funny because then I actually ended up in a PhD program to get my PhD in political science. Right. And I dropped out of that. Mm -hmm. And my mother, when I dropped out of that, my mother was like, okay, listen, you did not become a lawyer. You're not going to be a professor. At least become a mechanic. <laughs> oh, that was... <laughs> no, Steady I, work, man. Yeah, Steady and I, work. I, I asked her, I go, what are you, what are you talking about? She goes, Every, she goes, people need mechanics. Nobody needs an actor. <laughs> I was like, you know what? You're right. Oh, man. Because they want, listen, part of it is they want to be able to show off to the community. Like, oh, yeah. you know, my daughter, she's a, she's a, she's a lawyer. Yeah. I'm, I'm just saying, you know, <laughs> what does your daughter do? <laughs> my law, ha, ha, you know? <laughs> you know? But, and and, and um, were you always fine and like resolute in your ethnicity or were there moments when you were growing up where you were like, oh man. Man, I'll tell you, it's interesting because, you know, I came to America late 70s. I'm six years old. I don't know what's going on. Of course. Yeah. And then suddenly the hostage crisis happens. Right. And suddenly people are going around calling you an effing Iranian. And at first, I'm like, listen, dude, it's not Iranian, it's Iranian. Right. And, yeah, and secondly, you're bigger than me, so it's whatever you want it to be. You know? um, but then it's funny, because at a certain point, a lot of my friends just gave up on the whole Iranian thing, and they just said they're Italian. Oh, my God. I did the oh, same thing. Wow. You did it too? Oh, I was so embarrassed about being Mexican that I was like, that people would be like, oh, what's para? And I was like, um, Italian? <laughs> I didn't know that yeah. was like a trick you could do. Well, I, Indian <laughs> man, what's wrong with you? Yeah. 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 I was like, well, I'm Indian, you're oh, right. You did, it, did it work? Do you think you? You know, it's funny, it, it, it works sometimes. It was funny because a lot of my friends, no matter, <laughs> the funny thing is a lot of my Iranian guy friends, mm -hmm. the movie Not Without My Daughter came out. Right. Okay. And I don't know if you remember or not, but Sally Field marries an Iranian guy. He's very mm -hmm. nice in America, but then <laughs> And they go to Iran and it just becomes a jerk. He won't let her leave. He keeps the daughter. So that just really hurt any Iranian man's chances of, of, of go, go, getting a date. Right. right. So suddenly every, every one of my friends became uh, Italian. And what's funny is they all would go with Tony. <laughs> so you'd be out and yeah. suddenly you'd be like, hi, I'm Maz and this is Tony and Tony and Tony. <laughs> yeah. and I'm like, what do you guys use a yeah. new name? You know? <laughs> all these Persian Tonys. Like, yeah. Know and they, they would go from like Shah to Tony. <laughs> Like, what do you do? How do you, and, but the funny thing is, a lot of people that, that like in America, a lot of people don't know. And so yeah. all you got to do, you would speak Persian with an Italian accent. How do you do that? I, you, uh, chitori, khu, <laughs> behind me <chitori. laughs> That's good. That was, that was just me saying, how are you? Everything's good in Persian. But people would be like, oh, wow. I, I didn't know there was a lot of khaz in Italian. That was very interesting. Well, we, uh, we know that you, that you love accents. You're love, quite yeah. good at them. We actually want to play a little game with yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm very We're going to give you some it. phrases okay. and maybe some different accents. Do you mind uh, playing with us? Sure, and... I'm going to try. Oh, we're so excited. Do you want to okay, go first? Yeah, let me just give you a Satisfaction phrase. not guaranteed. Go ahead. <laughs> um, how about like a Kuwaiti border patrol okay. uh, saying, uh, 
I'm having a great time on White Guy Talk Show. Okay, um, it is very good here to be here today. Uh, <laughs> after I was, uh, I, I was at the border recently patrolling, which is what I do, and uh, <laughs> and uh, I'm very uh, uh, ecstatic, as we say, <laughs> ecstatic, as we say, to be here today um, on the White Guy Talk Show. It's very good that you finally recognize that even Kuwaiti border patrol have a lot of story to tell. <laughs> oh, no. oh, that's not bad. That's all right. Yeah. Uh, what, uh, maybe, maybe one more. Let's do. Ahead, How about, uh, let's see, uh, a Nigerian grandmother? A Nigerian yeah, grandmother. Saying, uh, hey, you're not watching White Guy Talk Show. What's your problem? Okay. I do not believe that you are not talking, that you are not watching the, uh, the White Guy Talk <laughs> Show. It is a very good show. It is about a lot of white guys. <laughs> but uh, they, it's all the topics, always white guys. So they just speak about the Congress, which is <laughs> filled with white guys. Very scary white guys. <laughs> watch, watch the White Guy Talk Show. I think that is almost Nigerian, or at least it is close to being some country in Africa. <laughs> so, I love it. Mom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Great well, we're gonna, we're gonna, we have a lot more with Mom coming up, but actually, could you toss a commercial toss in a different it. accent? Yes. How about this? How about saying to this camera, um, uh, in a Russian spy accent, oh. yes. we'll be right back with more Maz Jabrani. Okay. Hello, I am Sergey, and I am here to tell you we might be right back with more Maz Jobrani, but we might not. Stay tuned. Ooh, yeah. <laughs>